What's good out there guys, it's Roll Easy here and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to be going over all the problems and fixes uh, that people were going through on yesterday's solo money glitch video that I posted and we're going to go over all of that right after this. If you're brand new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of my latest videos. If you're also interested in GTA 5 online modded accounts, go ahead and go to my latest upload and click on this link in the description. This will lead you to the website Digizani. This is the most trusted site to purchase cash and rank services on all platforms for GTA 5 online at reasonable prices. Don't forget once you're done shopping, add the discount code EEZY to save some money at the end of your checkout. All right, so now that we're getting back into this, first of all, shout out to the founder once again, NHJ, sorry about that. His link will be down in the description. Now, what you're gonna need is you need to be in an invite only session. You need a facility. You need both Lester Heist Techs. I recommend having both Lester Heist Techs. I'm gonna go over how to get those here in a second. You need a CEO office. We've confirmed that pretty much every single one of them work. Now, we haven't confirmed that the CEO level one garage works, but we know level two and level three work. Okay, you want those to be full, and I'll tell you in a second what you wanna put in there. You need a mod shop in your CEO as well. You need just one custom plate, at least one. You don't need multiple, you just need at least one custom plate on the car you're duping. And like I said, the CEO garage that you're using needs to be full. You need at least an oppressor or a deluxo in there, just one, and you won't be overriding it, so don't worry. You also need the Benny's car that you're duping with a custom plate on it. We recommend the LG Retro Custom that sells for the most. And then fill the rest of the garage up with RH8s because that's what we're going to be, you know, riding over. Now, we're going to be going over these fixes right here. Trouble getting glitched out in the beginning, which is what we're going to go over right now. Then we're going to go over the cars not spawning outside. And like I said, the working CEO offices, we've confirmed Arcadius. In this video, I'm doing it at Maze Bank West, the cheap one. And we know this, the big Maze Bank Tower also works as well. Okay, so now we're gonna get glitched out. So I'm gonna go ahead in my facility, open up my phone, go to Play Quick Job, select Doomsday Heist, Alone, are you sure? Hit yes. You see I'm getting looking for job in the bottom right. Go ahead and just press pause, go to Online, Jobs, Play Jobs, Rocks are Created, and you wanna start up a Titan of a Job. Reason we're starting up a Titan of a Job, usually that puts you right back into the spot where you spawn the job from, okay? Go ahead and host or look for one, doesn't matter. Just make sure the job doesn't launch. You wanna be able to back out of it. So now that we're fully in the lobby, I can simply back out and confirm the alert. Now that we're back in the facility, open up your phone, go to play quick job, doomsday heist alone, are you sure? Go ahead. Now, this is where some people are having problems. They're saying that they just keep looking for jobs and nothing happens or they get shot straight up in the clouds. That will happen from time to time. As you can see right here, it actually took me a while. For those of you that just, you can't seem to find anything, just be patient. Look how many times I let it go for about a minute. And, and if at a minute, it doesn't find anything, I open up my phone and I restart the search once again. As you can see, I had to restart the search, I think three or four times here in this video. So I've restarted the search a bunch of times. Eventually I will find one. Okay, for those of you getting shot up in the clouds, that just happens sometimes. If you get shot up in the clouds, you just have to restart from the beginning, okay? That's just how it works, all right? Uh, try free aim sessions. If you're doing auto aim, try free aim. If you're doing free aim, try auto aim. Just try different targeting modes. Once you see populating lobby in the bottom right, you'll hear a click and everything. See populating lobby, two out of four, three out of four. Open up your phone immediately and just hit play quick job once. Just open the app and that's it. Once you've done that, check your style in the interaction menu. You cannot access this menu while on a mission. That's how you know you're glitched out successfully. Okay, so that's how that part works in the very beginning. Now that we've gotten glitched out in the facility, everything is pretty much smooth sailing from here. Now, what you wanna go ahead and do is, I like to go ahead and go to my concierge right here and just order up my buzzard so that I can fly back really easily over to the CEO office. So you saw right there in the bottom left, I got my two Lester Heist texts. This is for the people that are having problems with the car not spawning outside. A lot of people were saying certain CEO offices don't work because their car wasn't spawning. Not the case, okay? And I'm gonna go over that here in a second. So once you get to your CEO office, go to your garage level two or three. Those are the ones we know that are working. And you wanna have these set up already with the vehicles that we're gonna be using for the glitch. So the vehicles that I have in here are, I have at least one Deluxo or a Presser in here. And as you can see right here, I have it right there. So I'm gonna grab the Deluxo and I'm gonna go ahead and just drive it outside. I have my Benny's car I'm duping right there, plus RH8s to ride over. 
So grab your oppressor or deluxo. Either one will work. Once you go outside, you'll see you have no marker on the mini map. So there's no PV personal vehicle icon whatsoever on the map. Go ahead and go back into the garage where you pulled this vehicle out of. Okay, same garage, either two or three. Okay, that's what we've confirmed working. I haven't seen anybody get it to work with one yet. So now that you've done that, you want to go ahead and jump into the Benny's vehicle that you're duping. In this case, the Etro, the the Etro, <laughs> the LG Retro Custom. You want a custom plate on it to begin with already. Okay, now. Hit right D-pad to go into the mod shop. Once we're going into the mod shop, you just need to modify something on the vehicle. I changed the plate in the last video because that's just what I do for most of these glitches. But you really don't need to. You can just change the color of the plate if you really want to and you can save yourself, you know, some hassle of getting new plates and stuff like that. So you see, just modify one thing, hit exit the vehicle. No need to spam. I see a lot of YouTubers saying you got to spam right here. No, just get back in the vehicle. Look, I'm patient right here. Just hit right D-pad and you're good to go. No need to spam or press X or Y or anything like that. Just get back in the vehicle and hit right D-pad. Once you go back into the, uh, it'll lead you back into the CEO office. The car will automatically dupe just like that. Okay, so now you have the original here and the dupe. All right, the original I believe is the one that's flipped up and the, you know, the dupe is actually the one you were just in. So now you want to go ahead and go to the office by first you want to go to the elevator and select go to the office okay you want to do it in this order now once you enter into your office what you need to do is just turn right back around go back to the elevator and you want to exit to ground okay so exit to ground option right there so this is where some people are having problems some people are having problems right here uh, because the car is actually not spawning out on the ground. In my last video, I did this at Arcadius and I had no problem. The car was spawning on the ground every single time once I, once I did this. But as you can see on the mini map, the car is actually like inside the CEO office, maybe underground, maybe up in the air. Either way, we can't get to it. So this is the fix right here, okay? You need one of those Lester Heist techs. Now, I saw people getting it to work, and look, my Deluxe is still there with no icon as well. But uh, I've seen people get this to work with the green Lester Heist text. The way you get that green Lester Heist text is you need to do one setup from one of the, uh, you know, the old missions. All right. You see the green Lester Heist text. Those are the old heists. You need to just do a setup on one of them and then Lester will text you with one of these options. OK, so if you have this, go ahead and use it. This is the one to use probably because I've seen it work for other YouTubers. All right. Now what this is going to do, it's going to basically shoot you up in the clouds and bring you over to your heist uh, apartment. OK, whichever heist apartment you have, and it's going to load you into the lobby. Then once you load into the lobby, you simply want to exit the apartment and your car should spawn outside. Now, that didn't work for me. OK, as you can see, we're in the we're in the lobby screen. I back out and I'm going to exit apartment. My car should be outside, but it didn't work. Reason I think it didn't work for me is because I have Del Perro and Del Perro is literally right across the street from this maze bank office. I think the location was too close. Okay, car should be right outside, it's not, it's still stuck, okay? So, because of that, I actually had to use the other Lester Heist text. I opened up my phone and I used this one, the data breaches, which is the new Lester Heist text from the facility. Okay, the way you get that is you just pay for the first, uh, you know, initial setup to actually get the job or, you know, get the setups and everything to launch the missions. Once you do that, you'll spawn there and look, I spawn back outside and there my car is waiting for me. Okay, so for those of you that can't get it to work with the green Lester Heist text, the new blue Lester Heist text will work. Okay, that's how I got it to work. So once you've gotten your car, you want to go ahead and either drive it back or take a cargo bob back, but drive it back to your CO office to the same garage we were just using office garage two in this video okay so now that we're back in office garage two i can simply just write over one of these you know lgs that i have right here and there we go i just made a dupe successfully now to rinse and repeat you want to grab your your deluxo or your oppressor and simply drive it outside okay so i'm driving mine outside right now should have no personal vehicle icon you simply want to go right back inside uh for some reason i had a little bit of trouble here with the blue circle I think I probably spawned really close to the garage, didn't detect it. So now go back into that same garage where we just got glitched. Well, not really glitched out, it, but where we just got the Deluxo from. All right. And you're going to do what you did before. OK, it's a dupe every two minutes. Super, super easy. So get back into your LG Retro Custom that we're duping. Has a custom plate on it already. You remember, you only need one. You just want it in the car that you're duping originally. 
Now that we have that and we press right D-pad to go into the mod shop, you need to modify something, anything, super cheap, whatever you want to do. I modified the plate color. Okay, that's it. Back out of the menu, hit exit the vehicle. Once, you have, once you've exited the vehicle, press Y or triangle to get back in. You don't need to rush this at all, no spamming necessary. Just hit right D-pad and you'll simply drive back into the CEO garage where you just came from and you will have your dupe. All right, there we go. The car we're in right now is indeed the dupe. The one on top is the original, okay? So once you've done that, you can simply just go back into your office. So go to the elevator and go to the office. That's what we're doing right now. All right, this is all rinse and repeat. I think somebody actually officially timed it. It was two minutes and 10 seconds if your car spawns right outside. Uh, if your car isn't spawning, you got to do a little bit more stuff. But, you know, it'll be a dupe every, you know, three or four minutes for you guys to have to do the Lester Heist text method, which still ain't that bad. It's easy. All right. So go back to the elevator once you're in the office and hit exit to ground. And as you guessed it, my car is not going to spawn on the street like it did before. Uh, I really do believe it's if you saw my last video, it's when I did those two Lester Heist texts in the beginning where I said it was optional. Or it could be the CEO office, I'm not sure, but I believe that has something to do with why the car doesn't spawn out on the street. But like I said, the car's not out on the street, so I have to start up my Lester Heist text for the facility. Once I do that, I will spawn over into my facility heist room, and I just simply need to go outside, and my car will be waiting for me right outside. So I'm just going to call up a buzzer to get out there quicker, and as you can see, I have my other buzzer right there too. This is the same session, same everything, and there is my second dupe, all right? So yeah, it could take a little while. Maybe if you have to do it this way, I'd say call up maybe a cargo bob and then fly back over to your CEO office. Once you get to your CEO office, go to the same office garage we were using previously and we're going to accept that message and we're going to be writing over one of the free elegies, which is the only one I have left right over here. Right over it. There we go. Two dupes. Okay. So it takes a little bit longer with the Lester Heist method, but that's what you guys have to do if your car is not spawning out on the street. Okay. So I hope I covered everything that you guys were having problems with. I tried to be really thorough with this video. But uh, yeah, that's it. That's going to be it for me, guys. My name is Roll Easy. Please subscribe to the channel if you're brand new by pressing that big red button. Turn on post notifications and drop a fat like on this video and the rest of my videos for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. We are on the road to 50,000 subscribers. Peace out.